Hi, I'm Rob Cardona from World Motorsports, home of World Racing and Chris Rado's Crazy Sport Compact Project Vehicles. Today, we're gonna show you the install on an Innovate Motorsports MTXL air fuel ratio gauge. When you open this thing up, the first thing you're gonna come across is the programming cable. Then you have the sensor cable that runs directly to the O2 sensor that they provide you, which is the next thing we're pulling out here. Then you have the gauge itself, the multicolored faces that come with the gauge and the extra bezel, a weld-on bung in case you do not have something already welded into the car, and the instructions in a manual. Now that we know what all came inside the box, let's take a little bit of time to talk about the installation of this gauge. The guys at Innovate Motorsports have made installation really simple. There's a little bit of basic wiring, like you run a power, a ground, and a signal, and then there's also a wire for data logging if you are running an aftermarket ECU that runs data logging. After that, everything basically just connects with a one-way connector. So what we'll do is we're gonna cut our two and an eighth hole in where we're gonna put our gauge and then wire it up and start putting the O2 sensor in. Once you have the car up in the air, decide where you want the O2 sensor port to be, put it in place and screw it in. Okay, we just got done securing all the wiring. We cut our hole for our gauge. So I'm gonna install my gauge cluster piece again here. During ignition, you'll see that the gauge flashes through all of its analog dials, displaying all the different colors. Then it throws the gauge into the heater mode. The heater mode is when the gauge is actually warming up the O2 sensor, getting ready for its display. Now that the display is on, we're ready to take this thing out on the road. All right, now that I have the Innovate Motorsports air fuel ratio gauge installed in my car, I can accurately take it down to the dyno, tune it, and know exactly what my air fuel ratio is gonna be while I'm on the dyno and while I'm out on the streets pounding on my car.